What's up everyone, my name is King Goken and welcome to my 29th online tournament for Storm 3. Now this week's tournament has a very simple theme and the theme is that each player in this tournament must use a DLC outfit and the support characters must have DLC outfits as well. It's that simple. And overall I felt these matches were, they were pretty good. They are pretty good. You guys might agree with me, you may not agree with me, but the only way to find out is by watching these highly competitive matches unfold. Now with that said, let's go ahead and get this thing started. Alright, so we're in the first match of this tournament and right off the bat we have someone that broke a rule. And the only rule in this tournament is that you have to use characters that have DLC outfits and GamerZone for some strange reason picked Shikamaru. Shikamaru doesn't have a DLC outfit, so why he picked Shikamaru? It's, it, that, that's just mind boggling to me. I don't know. But who's going to win this match? Will it be Dark Mask? Or will it be Gamer Zone? Let's find out. That was a well played match by Dark Mask, who I should mention is the current reigning champion of my online tournament series. He fought well. He took out Gamer Zone, but how far will Dark Mask get in this week's online tournament? Continue watching to find out. And you can see right there that Gamer Zone is mad. Alright, we're at the second match in this tournament. We have Break the Code 98 taking on Goku Sage King. And you can see right here that Goku Sage King has a character that does not have a DLC outfit. And you can see right there that Gamer Zone is still mad about his match. You know, he's cursing. He's angry. And I was going to edit out all this cursing, but you know what? I'm just going to leave it in the video because I want you guys to see just how angry Gamer Zone really is. Now let's go ahead and check out this match. <laughs> Thank you, 
All right, we're at the third match in this week's online tournament. We have Can Jack Ope 99. I don't know how to say his name. Can Jack Ope 99. He's taking on Soul Heart RS. They're both using DLC costumes, so that's good. Now, would this match be good? You're about to find out. Alright, we're at the next match in this tournament, and we have myself, King Gilbert, taking on Outlaw Eagle. We're both using DLC for our characters and for our support. So this this might be a good match, it might be a bad match. Will I make it to the semifinals or will I be stopped right here? Ladies and gentlemen, you are about to find out. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
For the next match in the tournament, we have the reigning champion Dark Mask taking on Goku Stage King in the semi-finals battle. What's going to happen? Will Dark Mask make it to the finals once again, or will Goku Stage King do the impossible and defeat Dark Mask? Ladies and gentlemen, you're about to find out. <laughs> For the next match in this tournament, we have So Hard RS taking on Outlaw Eagle Naruto versus Sasuke. Let the battle begin. <laughs> Let's 
That was a very entertaining match to watch. They both fought well, but only one person can move on, and that person was so hard RS. And he'll be taking on Goku Sage King in a championship match of this week's online tournament. And who's gonna be the new champ? Will it be Goku Sage King or will it be So Hard RS? Ladies and gentlemen, you're about to find out. <laughs> Well, there you have it guys, we have a new champion, and that champion is Goku Sage King, and yes, he did break the all DLC costume rule, but I let that slide because he fought well in this week's online tournament, and I felt that he deserved that championship win. And with that said, that concludes this week's online tournament. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, PC online tournaments for Storm 3 will be coming soon, and I'll be doing an Xbox 360 Storm 3 tournament in the future. So uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. And until next time, King Oaken out.